You be careful around these parts, little dragon. There be more ghosts in this here shipyard than I can shake my pick at. Darn shame, too, because I was mighty close to finding my treasure.
you'll hit a daggum egg in my treasure. Here, waters used to be my favorite diving spot, but I can't get any loot with these subs patrolling around. Think you can pilot this here sub I bought for scrap? All righty then. Press the jump button to speed on up, and when you get a sub in your sights, the torpedo will start to lock on. If you get a good lock on, fire away with the attack button.
have some mean sub-driving skills. Why don't you have this here egg as a reward? Ask your help again. There'd be even more subs that don't come out of nowheres. If you could blast them, I could use this acid lake as my swimming hole again. Darn tootin'.
Hello. I thought you might be hungry. Thanks. Did you bring any chips? I'm sorry this happened, but I tried to warn you. I had to help Spyro rescue the eggs. You just don't understand. If we don't bring dragons back to this world soon, all our magic will be lost. The dragons used to live here? Yes, this was their original home. But a long, long time ago, the sorceress banished them to the other side of the world. She didn't realize the dragons were the source of all our magic. Maybe I could convince the dragons to come back, if you let me go. I'm sorry. I can't. We urgently need your help. The evil cat wizards of Felinia have stormed our castle and captured our princess. If we don't stop them right away, they'll force her to marry Prince Azrael. Spyro, we urgently need your help. The evil cat wizard...
today is your lucky day. The wizards and I have worked out a little deal. If you simply pay a small toll, they'll be happy to raise these steps and let you pass. You have chosen wisely, Spyro. I'll tell the wizards to raise the steps immediately. Oh, and uh, best of luck rescuing that princess, or whatever it is you're up to. The wizards only agreed to raise the steps. They never said they wouldn't lower them again. <laughs> Those guys are pretty clever, aren't they? Isn't Prince Asriel just the dreamiest? The other fairies and wizards won't let us get married, so we're going to elope. By the way, Asriel says you can have this egg if you don't tell anyone where we went.
Jack Sparrow and boldly go where no dragon has gone before. Well, at least not in a thousand years, at any rate. to create a monster to end all monsters. <laughs> and I'm going to send it out to destroy all the dragons, even the little hatchlings. Yes, yes, it will smash them and crush them and grind them and tear them. Oh, yes. Smear them and smush them and crack them and crease them. Let me out of here, you. But uh, won't that kill them? <laughs> it doesn't matter, as long as I can still collect their wings! What? All this time you've only wanted them for their wings? Of course, you ignorant girl! I need them for a spell so I can live forever! Uh, wait a second. A, a spell? What did you think I was going to do with all those dragons? Open a zoo? <laughs> Ooh, if I had my blaster, you'd be singing a different tune! You know what I mean? You said just keeping them in our world was enough. You never said you had to kill them. I don't have to kill them. It just stops them from wriggling so much. You're terrible. I can't believe I ever listened to you. Stupid, insolent brat. I'll take care of her as soon as I finish off that dragon. Now, where was I? Ah, yes. <laughs> well, this is gonna get real ugly. <laughs> ah. This might be our last stand, Spyro. The sorceress plans to use this monster to destroy every iota of her opposition, beginning with the two of us. Alas, there is no time for ruminating. A battle awaits us. I will endeavor to assist you by means of a steady provision of combustible projectiles.
Hi, Bianca. Did you bring any more food? I'm starving. There's no time for that, Hunter. We have to stop the sorceress. She's gonna kill all the dragon hatchlings. Wait a minute. Why should I trust you? This could be another trap. You're in a cage, you furry numbskull. How can I trap you by letting you out? I don't know. You sorceress types can be sneaky. <sighs> I never thought we were going to hurt the dragons. Come on, we don't have time for this. <laughs> Trust me, but I want to help you stop the sorceress. There's a way to open a hidden portal to her lair, but it'll take some very strong magic. If you can find more of the dragon eggs, I think my magic will be strong enough to open the portal. I'll come find you when you have enough eggs, okay? What I have here. It's a life-size space monkey action figure, complete with a fully operational laser. I'd love to let him out so you can play with him, but the sorceress seems to think he's a menace. Ha <laughs> ha! You've always had a weakness for helping silly little creatures, haven't you, Spyro? Ah oh, well, I suppose there couldn't be any harm in letting him out. Could there? Say, you ever see a bear dance? <laughs> uh, no? <laughs> well, it's your lucky day! Check this out. <laughs> Quite a dancer, isn't he? Not much stamina, though. Too bad I had a lot more ammo left. <laughs> Anyway, I heard all about how you've been fighting a sorceress and her armies and kicking all that butt, and I just wanted to say, Huzzah! Yippee! Woohoo! 
wish she could stay, but my homeworld's been overrun by Rhinox since I've been captured. If you happen to see the sorceress, tell her I'll be giving her dancing lessons real soon. Know what I mean? You bet. Later! <laughs> Did you see a Rhinoc? I thought I saw a Rhinoc. Ooh, take it from me, Spyro. Never spend a week in a cage. Mm -hmm. Next thing you know, your whole island will be knee-deep in Rhinox. Well, gotta go. Mr. Laser Blaster and I have a whole lot of work to do. Ah, Agent Nine, my favorite pupil. Welcome back to my island laboratory. I'm afraid Rhinox have taken over the entire island. Could you stop them before they destroy all my research? It'll be just like old times. Try shooting these dummies to get warmed up. 